where is this? It's like a little hidden gem in here. There it is. Glisten. Wait, did we do glistening ganache? We may have done something from this. Mmm. I don't remember if I liked it. Sweetly said. Okay, so... Um, all right. 1730, here we go. Elysium. Did we do? Yes, we did on stream 14. Um... We did it. We did a listening Ganesh. Uh, but this is sweetly said. Does it all come from this album? Looks like it. I don't remember glistening Ganesh at all. I don't remember if I liked it. Uh, so I guess we will see what sweetly said is like. Definitely got a Cocteau Twins guitar tone in there. This is nice. Um, wow, just a few days ago, this had a remaster release. Look at this. Wow. Is it a bit longer? No, it's the same, same, same track listing. That's cool. From the Numero group. Cool. Vocals are really uh, peculiar. I'm not in love with the with the vocals. The inflection. Remember the area song from last year? Anyway, yeah, it said that there was a related artist from 97 to 2003. 
That was cool. Um, like I said, vocals weren't quite all there for me. There was a little too, um, I don't know. I, I also feel this way about this band that I reviewed. What was it? Pure Bathing Culture. Um, I do like this album quite a bit. In spite of uh, like a very sophisticated poppy um, type of like, uh, I wouldn't say sassy, but very um, inflected vocals, I guess you could say, that come with sophisticated pop. And it just kind of clashed with the dream pop. And that's sort of the vibe I got here. Uh, you might be a little bit behind, Andreas. I can't tell. Um, that's kind of the vibe I got here, but those guitar tones, man, you can just eat those up. And this looks like the Head, or, head Over Heels cover, too. I don't know, but that was cool. That was cool. Thank you for that. 